Welcome back, this is Xbox Tavern. My name is Daniel and I am taking you through a review of The Wild 8. This hype train digital title is going to take you through a wild ride. Once you start the game you have a choice of 8 characters, each person has a different perk. Then your game starts. Unfortunately you've just been a survivor of a plane crash in Alaska. And you have to battle the elements to survive and tell the tale of The Wild 8. While playing this on the Xbox, I did feel that this was probably more suited to a PC setup. Point and click keyboard would have been so much easier. It's a tiny bit convoluted with your controller trying to press different buttons to either craft or even remember how to pick up a stick, light it on fire so you could have a torch. But that was probably more my problem than the controller's problem. There isn't much of a hand holding within the game. It is a case of you exploring your area, trying to find out where to go next. And then even when you do find out where to go, the map is so vast, you could be traveling in the wrong direction until you explore that area. Kind of like the fog of war in uh, certain RTS games. You do earn ability points so you can run faster, run for longer. Um, craft better and stronger weapons um, and this is all earned by playing the game and doing the things you should be doing like seeking resources and killing animals yes animals attack you you can also capture rabbits to eat um, and then also you have to cook that item so you don't get food poisoning which is a nice little um, added bonus while doing all this you also have to manage your food resources, your coldness, so you do get cold during the winter night, so you have to build a fire to keep yourself warm. Fans of survival games, building bases and managing your resources, this is definitely a game for you. There is no hand holding, there is no easy path to choose, and whatever you decide to do, there is always a consequence. Stay and build a fire, you could be attacked by wolves. Take on the wolves and attack them, there could be a pack and a few more could come and that fight could be slightly harder. If you're intrigued about this game, please head over to xboxtavern.com where you'll have my conclusions and score for this game. If you enjoy gaming reviews, make sure you subscribe to the channel. We are posting content weekly. We also have a podcast. There is also a giveaway currently going on. Check the description below. I've been Daniel. Take care. Until next time. Bye bye.